Welcome to my channel. This is a general reading for the sign of Pisces. My readings are timeless, so when you see them is when you're meant to hear them. I want to thank everyone for the love and support that they have shown me towards my channel. And for my new subscribers, welcome. If this reading resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe. And remember to click the post bell so you get alerts when videos are posted. So Pisces... What does Pisces need to know, spirit? Spirit, what information does Pisces need to know? Okay, we have temperance for one, Pisces. And then we have the moon for number two okay so temperance is about balance moderation peace and patience it reminds you to go with the flow in your life um instead of trying to force a pace or direction um the page of coins Temperance is a message message to take things as they come and remain flexible enough to change with the changes. It's like trust your inner voice. So Pisces, you may have put a plan into play and it might not be going the way you really particularly want it to go. And so that's basically just saying that don't just go with the flow basically is what it's saying. Okay. And that's the 10 of coins. So then we have the moon. The moon is about changes, dreams, fear, like unnecessary fear. The moon is greatly connected to your subconscious. Um, it represents the thoughts, the feelings, the doubts, and the fears that you carry internally. Um, you may be feeling anxious right now, allowing the fears to override like your faith in the future. So this is telling me like reminding you to go with the flow but it also feels like because things are not going the way that you want them to right now in Pisces it's like you're afraid it may be causing a lot of anxiety and you just don't know like if things are really going to work out but you should trust it's saying you should trust that they will and then you have the page of coins the page of coins is like the apprentice card so that's like possibilities commitments to learning something new um, things that will make you money in your future. So that's like learning new skills. Like I told you earlier before, I'm going to take this card just because it flipped over. I'm sure you saw it. That's the three of cups. Learning new skills, going back to school, adding additional skills, maybe to something that you're already doing or completely changing your path and direction on, you know, what you how you make money um the ten of coins pisces is like affluence abundance financial success prosperity generational wealth karmic gifts and security so i feel like somebody is not trusting the direction that they're choosing like you have questions like it's almost as if you're second guessing yourself but you have the Ten of Coins, and then you have the Three of Cups, which, as you saw that card, it looks like a really positive card. And it's like celebrations, weddings, baby showers, having fun with your friends, your family, like living in the moment. So it feels like to me, like, because you're so worried about what's going to happen, you know, in your future, you might not be taking the time to just enjoy the moment, um, take time out to have an attitude of gratitude, you know, just be thankful for what is the positive things that are actually happening in your life right now, even though there may be a couple of storms brewing around you in different areas or different aspects of your life, there are some good things that are actually taking place. There are some good things that are happening and you need to just take the time to celebrate those moments. That's the Ace of Coins. So then you have the Ace of Coins and the Ace of Coins is like divine gifts of abundance in all areas of your life. Material security, manifestation of your goals, new talents or skills being revealed. And like I said, up, up there with the page, 
there's new skills developing. This also makes me feel like your new spiritual gifts, like now you're starting to learn to play around with them. Maybe one of your manifestations has actually, you know, come into light. You're able to touch it. Um, new spiritual gifts as far as being able to talk to the divine or talk to spirits or just basically able to see things happen before they actually happen. So Pisces, I'm feeling like somebody is manifesting with their new gift and that's what's making them afraid but temperance is like having patience like this gift hasn't fully developed because you're working on it you're playing around with it and you you know see that it's working here and there it's like hit or miss and sometimes like because you want certain things to happen faster than what they are, you get a little bit af afraid and then it starts to cause some anxiety in you. And then maybe you don't want to, you know, push forward or it makes you feel like you want to quit. But this is basically saying you need to, like this, these are some really good cards, actually, Pisces, because 10 of coins, 10 of pentacles, celebrations, and the ace of coins, like divine gifts, you're bringing some of these things closer to you. And this whole thing is like, be patient. Give it some time. It's not a microwave type thing, but it's going to happen fast because your other reading that I did previously says that it's going to come in and it's going to come in quickly. But you wanted it the minute you manifested it. You wanted it to happen. Snap right now. And it's going to happen quick, but maybe it's not happening as fast as you would like it to. So I think this is like the thing um, when I told you guys before. God may not come when you call, but he's always on time. So it's going to happen on time. Just trust and know that. Continue on developing your skills. Continue on, you know, manifesting. Continue on trying to bring this future that you want closer to you. But also enjoy the moments. Enjoy your time that you have with the people that you have now. Because for some reason, I'm feeling like somebody that you're around might not have the amount of time that you think that they have. And so you need to enjoy them. I know things are happening around and in your life that maybe you might not know, you know, how to deal with or how to handle them. But at the end of the day, you see the blessings. You know that they're there. You can feel them because of the energy. You know that your life is about to change. But right here, like with this card, it almost makes me feel like this person has strings this looks like a little heart let me show this to you this little area right here right there looks like she has a string around her heart and this one is kind of almost the same so it's like they have angel wings and she has her eyes closed like she's trying to meditate she also has the sun behind her head so this card but it's not like she's entangled a little bit so just be careful, you know, not to just remember to go with the flow, like it says, and also be flexible in how you handle people, like your relationships, be flexible, like if stuff changes with your job, um, be flexible with your lover, be flexible, just even with yourself, like don't get frustrated when you're trying to manifest and it's not happening the way that you want it to. It's like, don't be afraid, but it's because even with the moon, like I'm telling you, the moon is like, and I used to tell you guys this all the time. So if you go back in some of my readings and when I explain the moon, it's like the big pile of clothes that you have in your chair. And at nighttime, it looks like a big old monster. But when you turn the lights on, you can see that it's nothing but clothes. So it's like trying to manifest your dream life through a little fear, a little anxiety, and a little, like, little... What does this lady have in her hands? I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like she has something in her hands. I can't really tell what they are. They look like birds or something. But there's wolves behind her. And these houses look like they're both leaning. Actually, it looks like the mirror reflection. That's what it looks like, like it's in reverse. One of those pictures where you kind of can flip everything. So that also is saying, don't make like 
decisions that could potentially alter your life right now. So it's like taking the time, even with the temperance, like I said, being patient and just taking the time to develop you, develop your skills, develop, I mean, you as a person, honestly, like, and to go within your mind, body, and soul and just try to make you a better person. So hopefully I explain this properly, Pisces, but it's like you're manifesting because down here, everything is beautiful. Like you're manifesting greatness towards you. So Pisces, this is your reading. If it resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Remember to click the post bell so you get alerts when videos are posted.